bit flabbergasted. We noticed just a week ago, lots of local residents. This, behind us, Pret-a-Manger. And there are so many chain coffee parlours everywhere. And this is really rubbing our nose into it because this area, all under the, under the Westway here, the famous Westway, the Clash, lots of people who knew the Clash knew about the Westway. Uh, this is sacred land. To me, this is the heart of civilization. We're, we're civilization in the world. I'm a Londoner, proud Londoner. And here under this motorway, under this concrete, I see... I, I don't want to put a monchie. Who wants to put a monchie here? Who asked them? Do you want to put a monchie? Do you want more coffee? Another chain? Um, just gone behind our backs there's just been no consultation there's been no kind of communication with with the com local community so we can have our say um we're just heading to an ordinary high street and we're losing our uniqueness and what this community is all about We're here to show that, like, you know, it's never too late to take a stand, you know. There's so much that's been going on that you can't keep your eye on everything, you know. But we're still here and we're still watching and we're still vigilant and we have to let them know that. These premises will be under protest and leafleting from now till they're probably closed. It's going to be impossible for them to do any type of business. You can imagine the well-heeled mothers will come with their children to the prep school around the corner and they're going to be faced with people who are angry that their property and their land has been taken away from them. So the council's actually doing these kids and these mothers a disservice. We don't want them here, of course. This land belongs to local people. It's brilliant, this protest getting so much uh, support, the people going past, weeping their horns, thumbs up. I'm amazed, frankly, that this is still going ahead. After what we've been through in the last eight months, it should have been put a stop to. Why are they doing this? It's like a smack in the face for the community, We're taking yet another community asset, putting it into private hands. I know this was being planned a long, long time ago. The council, if they're really listening, should have stepped in and stopped this. Hand it back to the community. It's community land. This isn't going to stop. This is going to go on for months. They're not going to have a happy business here. And I support this very peaceful protest. Great style. Thank you.